Welcome ladies and gentlemen to Sports Circle 345 and as I always say, this is the place where we discuss track and field in its entirety. The track and field season is over but there were some memorable performances and one of the performances that stood out to me was the under 20 girls breaking that 4x100 meters world record in Cali, Colombia. Do you remember that? We want to show that today and just reminisce in what happened. Can anybody remember who were the persons on that team? Let me give you a hint. Serena Cole. Anybody can remember the next three persons who were on that team? Let's watch a video and find out. Let me see if your memory is as good as mine. Hmm. Welcome to Sports Circle 345. Jamaica has broken the junior girls 4 by 100 meter world record to win gold at the U20 World Championships in Cali, Colombia. Jamaica sped to victory in emphatic style while the world watched in amazement as they took down their opponents with every slick and precise bat and change. The quartet of Tina and Tia Clayton, Carica Hill and Serena Cole blazed to 42.59 seconds in the reign of the South America country to break their own record set in Kenya last year. Jamaica had recently ran a time of 42.58 seconds at the recently concluded Carifta Games in Kingston. However, that time was not ratified by World Athletics due to a Jamaica Anti-Doping Commission, Jatco Blunder. Officials failed to test all four athletes on the relay team, rendering the time void under World Athletics rules. For context Jamaica's gold medal winning run in Cali today, would have been good enough to play sixth in the finals of the senior event at the women's finals at the World Championships in Eugene, Oregon. The women's U20 team showed the senior ladies how it's done, the team of Jackson, Fraser Price, Kemba Nelson and Elaine thompson Hera loose to a better prepared American 4x100 meter team last month. This shows that Jamaica has depth in women's 100m and 4x100m team selections, also Jamaica's track and field program is producing more world-class female athletes more than any Caribbean country at the moment. The future is bright and illustrious. Thanks for watching, until next time God bless. Oh, did you remember that race? Yes, that was one of the best races for me in 2022. I love it for more than one reason. Because these young girls prove that irrespective of what happened in the national stadium, they came back and they won that race and won it convincingly and broke the record a second time. And this is how it is perseverance. There are times in life that you will fall down, you get up and you go. And these Jamaican ladies prove just that. Continue to watch Sports Circle 345.